is now loading up the paint block with some 35 cal and you put them in skirt first into those holes that are uh, really tapered so it makes it easier. Norm's got some big fingers. For him to be able to do this this quick is really something, I guess, right? Oh yeah, man, they just drop right in. They're awesome. Like you said, I got big fingers and they just drop right in, man. Then, we'll take the uh, bottom, put it over top. Push them together. Yeah. Forces up all the backs of the pellets up tight against the uh, pad. Then we take our paint shield, put over top so you don't keep filling in the holes with paint on your actual block. So we use these, I call them paint pads, paint shields, whatever you want to call them. And I just take rubber band, go around those two ears, go underneath, go around those two ears. You can use these paint pads at least 10 times before you got to throw them out and get new ones but and it's that simple you can see you know you can take this with rubber bands and you can adjust this so it's absolutely perfect and we go out and we put one coat of white paint on them and let it dry 15 minutes then we put our neon color whether it be pink uh, yellow orange and let that sit 15 minutes and then we shoot one coat of clear on it the clear helps uh, pick up any type of reflection from the sun. That's all it takes. So you're doing the yellow now, Norm? No, this is clear coat. I did the oh, white. Okay. Then I did the green, and now I'm doing the the uh, clear coat. You could see the difference. See how they shine? Oh, you. Oh, and you only filled this one. Oh, I see. So that's a half filled tray there. Yeah. And this is dulled until I hit them with the clear coat. Okay, yeah, yeah. And then that's what, when you can see what the sun does to it. So when you're scoping stuff and in your camera, any type of sun that hits the back of these with this clear coat shines like a beacon. That's, that's all it, it takes. Yeah, this is just from Walmart. Okay, yep. Yeah. I get it in pink too. And I like the um, flat white primer for the base. And then just a regular clear. Like I said, I get all this at Walmart. And uh, man, they, they show up beautiful through the camera and uh, through your scope when you're shooting. And you get is 121 yes. rounds per tray. It's 121 per tray. Yeah. That beats painting one by one. Yeah. Just drop them in there and you can see how quick it goes. So, and they'll dry in 20 minutes. Then I could reload them all up again. Just like Skittles. Yeah. Every single one. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're hot from being in the sun. Yeah, they are. Good and dry. Yeah. Yep.